Hello, hello, and welcome to part 8 of the Menta Roulette journey. Last time I talked about why Savage is such a bad idea for Menta status, because let's be real, it's a really bad idea. Maybe if it was its own third Menta type, but not as a battle Menta requirement. This time though, I want to focus on why the current requirements are dumb, and what a good requirement is. A lot of people have ideas on that, but not all of them are good, as we have established. So, the leveling every role to level cap and completing role quests, yeah, that is fine. I don't think really anyone thinks this is overly punishing or bad. You've at least experienced every role. You trial by fired. Even if you suck, you've been on that end of the experience. It doesn't really show or prove much, but like, it's fine as a time gate. What I think is an absolutely asinine choice is the decision to involve commendations. I have long stopped caring about these beyond the, hey, I carried the hell out of this group, why did I not get them? The number, over 7200 as of this recording, holds no meaning to me beyond whatever possible future they add more commendation achievements. You used to need, what was it, 500 commendations for mentorship? That's not too high, decently okay enough to get that much, but a pointless time gate. You needed to clear 1000 duties already, so what's the point? Then they increased it to a massive 1500. That is a lot of commendations and is absolutely a terrible decision, objectively. And it's very easy to prove that with one word. People. My motto has always been, commendations are random. Because they are, since the players you get paired with are random. Every player is a different person. Every different person has their own priorities of how to give out commendations. The one and only time, I believe only time, I got all seven commendations of a raid was because of my Wesker look. Not because I taught the party how to do the fight. Not because I was the only DPS who didn't repeatedly die on the winning run. Not because of skill or anything, but my character look and glamour. Now, tell me how my look at all elevates me as a player to be worthy of mentorship? It doesn't do a damn thing. There's a lot of reasons players will give comms. Skill, jokes, or even just being their favorite race. What criteria you need to do for comms is random every new duty. Personally, I don't care how nice you are, what your glam is, anything. I care about two things on a typical run. Ability, or ability to learn. If you are a god player, I will calm you. Someone being awful, but genuinely taking every piece of advice to improve, also gonna earn my calm. I doubt I'm the only one like this, and even if I'm not, I myself prove the point. Whether you randomly get queued with me is all luck. From there, it's a matter of if you can earn my calm. I genuinely don't care if you think be nice will get you all the calms. That's not exclusively true, much as a lot of people seem to think so. Being nice will never earn you my commendation, or the commendation of many people. Now the opposite, being a complete ass and cursing people out, that'll probably lose you my calm, and the calm of a lot of people. Some people still won't care though. You do what they wanted, you could be the biggest jerk in the world and still get the comms. Once again, it's random. Some people will give you comms because you did the huge task of... tanking. Could be a terrible tank, but you did tank. Enjoy a calm. Healed? Well, people died five times total this run, to no fault of their own. But healing is so hard or such. Casting a single AoE heal is very difficult. Have a calm. Some people don't calm at all. It's a time gate that encourages playing non-DPS, and that's about it. That's the main thing I see as increasing calm count. Play tank, play healer. Play DPS and get far less. Many players can't recognize good play, even if it's not their fault. So DPS are going to languish, since by default, the tank and healer are doing more for the group just by being those roles. Comms are a terrible metric for this alone. What about Menta comms? Make a Menta commendation system. Have people fill out some kind of thing at the end of a duty with Mentors. Go to the timestamp on screen. Meet me back here in about maybe three minutes. You're ignoring two other points too. For one, even if comms are easy to do, a mentor review system would be too much work for some. How many times I've talked to people who've told me reporting a person was too much work? 
This mindset isn't a one-off, so you're gonna get people putting little to no effort into the review. For two, people like this? These are the people who are going to be writing the reviews, who will ignore five minutes of talking about a subject in a video to go, well, you said these two words in this order? It doesn't matter what words you used before it or after it. You assume people would interact with a Mentacom system with honesty and integrity? These intros are too much for them to handle. You trust them to write honest feedback or calm what would be the good mentors? So what is a good mentor requirement? None. There is no simple thing they could implement that would fit something as complex as this. There is no one measure of a good mentor, nothing you could track that determines someone is good at it. What you can do though, is report the jerks. If you really care, report the people who actually did stuff wrong. As far as earning to be a battle mentor, I fundamentally disagree that anyone can make a good, simple requirement. If they wanted some entire course for mentorship, that would already be in the game. And I doubt that any course would be able to check through everything a mentor could want to be. And GMs reading applications? Yeah, good luck with that. Not like you can't fake an application. Someone's never been job hunting if you think that couldn't be gamed immediately. Oh, oh god, that was a lot longer of a talk than I expected. But like, I mean, let's be real, it was needed. The proposed fixes just don't work the way people expect. But let's not dally anymore, this episode's list of duties is a hell of a ride. I managed to get every job I've not queued as before it done, but that's the least interesting part of what happened. Please rate, comment, subscribe, follow my socials and discord. Please check the description, I work hard on them. Alright, so I have only two jobs I have not yet done any mental roulettes on. One of them's Monk. Oh god, um... Okay, good. Yeah, remember, uh, this glitch. My chakra gauge is not supposed to be all the way up there. So I have to use two just to get my chakra gauge. Huh? Here we go. Oh my god, my helmet's... Holy crap, 570? I gotta buy a helmet. Oh wow, I thought I was gonna have time to go buy... Oh, it's Greg. No, wait, I gotta fix this. There, Samurai is also good. Under the armor. That was quick. Hi, Doggle. Now let's see if I can't remember how I'm supposed to do this opener. Where is my, where is arm's length? Oh my god, that actually worked. Holy crap. That should not have saved me. I should not have lived that. I got some really good dodges out of that. Pet the doggo, 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 pet the doggo. Oh. Hi. I could be playing Unicorn Overlord right now. Such devastation. This was not Galerius' intention. No, actually it was Galerius' intention for sure. Alright, that was a good number of monk runs. Oh, ninja. Ninja is difficult. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. Hutan. I know Sweetan. This is... Yeah. That's Hoshio Ranryu. Well. That's Hoshio Ranryu. Alright, let's go. Waiting on cue. I do find it funny how Monk was getting, like, near-instant cues, but Ninja? No, nin Ninja's not allowed cues. Ninja's not allowed to have any good cues. Five minutes has have, have elapsed? Yeah, now things can pop, right? Or not. Oh my god, finally! It's, it's Lapis Manalis again!
Really? Why is this white mage using cure one? I'm not allowed to use Doton, am I? At least I brought it into this one. Can I have a tank that doesn't ignore my Dotons this time? Please? Oh my god. Wait. It better not be. It better not be. Okay. <laughs> I would have been so furious if it was Lapis Manalis again. I never thought about doing that one that way. Honestly? Cool. Can I get a non-guild hast that isn't Lapis Manalis? Oh no, did I just... <laughs> I mean, I did ask for it. Okay, that's not that bad. Bye! Bye! It's Lapis Manalis again! Now, I'm pretty sure this guy's not going to do it, but just in case. I mean, I can't say I'm not trying. I just wanted people in my Doton. Go in my Doton, please. Alright, so now that I've done every job as part of the Menta Roulette series, I can now do what I want. Without any feeling of, ah, but I should be doing this other job. I should be doing this or that or... That's just some white mage. Oh, anti-tower. They were just standing in that. This guy is not even trying to dodge. Um, are they gonna... Help? They're not taking enmity. Why did you move? I thought that would snap chop, but why why did why did you move? That was close. Why are they? They are now only using their AOE. Oh, I might be dead. Oh, I'm not dead. 
Oh. I'm their tank now. I'm just our tank. Oh my god. I got the music at least, but oh my god, that was painful. I regret doing that. Let's do another. I'm gonna regret this one too, aren't I? This might be fun. If the tank knows what they're doing. They don't know what they're doing at all. Oh boy. And this black mage doesn't know anything about their rotation. Oh no. Yep, yeah, nope, they just tried to kill themselves. Have they used raw intuition at all yet? Are they are they gonna are they gonna use it? No? I really hope this guy listens. I'm the only one who survived. <sighs> well, I told them about raw intuition like, hey. You're just hitting, he's just hitting buttons at random. Home gang does not do anything. They turned off the, wait, when did they turn off the stance? They're, they're gonna, are they not? Well, if I die, I die. Hey, turn it back on. Oh my god. All right, nope, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Oh no, I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. I am not done. So let's make it worse than Sage. Actually, no, it's tank in need. I want to get I want I want the money. Gunbreaker. I'm probably going to regret that actually. Why did I do that? I'm going to hate everything. Oh. Hello. Why did they use Medica 2? Med Medic Medica 2 is not that good. Why why are they still use what what okay? I thought this was swipe, not swing. Hey look, a reason to use Medica 2. Well, they're not listening. Remember the part where I said I I was going to regret this? Wait, I just realized I don't have music on. Whoops. Well, that's not good. Where are you going? They're using DPS, so it's not like they can't use Holy. They've used Holy. They just got destroyed by a ton of AoEs. Melees are leaving the boss. What is with this low DPS? What did you cure to Benediction? I don't remember if I pull him north or if I leave him mid. Okay, yeah, I was right. Leave him mid. <laughs> and nothing. Cool. None of the comms. Yep. Why do I even bother? For my note for that last dungeon, I put Medica 2, 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 Medica 2. Remember, if you want to see more about my, my, 
my notes and all that, I have a thing in the description that shows you every duty I've done so far and a totals of how many of each thing I've done. Oh, you know, this this dungeon's kind of boring. Oh, uh, no, the Dragoon knows who I am. Why are they spamming Cure 2? Why are they spamming Cure 2? Where are you going to... Are you going to use your tools? You're not using any of your tools. Right, I'm just going to do that. Oh my god, they actually used holy. Oh my gosh, it's a miracle. All right, we lived. I have maybe super belied left. All I gotta do is just live to the end of the the smacking. Please, please, no! Oh, I got all three comms at least. Oh boy. Do I dare do one more? I dare. Yeah, I should have... I should have guessed it would be a dungeon still. Oh no, 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 not Medica 2 again! Oh, at least they're using Holy. At least they're using Holy. There's a reason why I never pulled this one too. Like, why are they hiding back there? There's free, free uptime right here. <laughs> Zero. Oh my god, they're using Holy still. Nice. They actually did it on the right timing. Like, they don't trust me. They don't trust me to read these. Oh, hey! Benediction! Smart benediction usage! Oh my god. I'm not used to having good, good healer. Well, that was a roller coaster of emotions. So let's ruin it with one more. Okay, I ruined it. Oh god, I hate this dungeon. Well, the healer is, I can't heal stupid, so... Well, they don't know how to holy. I don't remember how to tank this one at all. But you know, you want me to expect- you expect me to remember every extreme as well, so... I should remember how to do this dungeon, boss, just that I haven't seen in years. And the dead. Yep. Luckily, I don't need, like, any help. I mean, yeah, that did disappoint me, but at least it's not as hard as it used to be. Please use holy. It's strong and useful and just please. Also, let me use my dotons. I was ready to, like, not include most runs, only if something interesting happens. And yeah, I was doing that. Then I get back-to-back -back stories for Doton, and then again for just normal healing, and then for Holy. Also, sorry if anyone can tell the difference with the video quality. Again, please explicitly tell me if the first few sections you can tell a difference. This might not be a, like, super HD game, but I've been asked what mods I'm using enough to know my normal recording techniques are good. And the answer is none, by the way. I won't be the target of malware like a certain person was. My game just looks like this purely vanilla. Wait, this is Minecraft. Take care and may the power of Anne and Inhogsley waste to your enemies.